Parents in Bridgeton are upset after they say a dump truck driver directed a profanity-laced uh, tirade at a bus driver while young children were boarding the bus. At least one parent also heard a racial slur used. Fox 2's Chris Renier is live in Bridgeton where he's been talking with everyone involved. Chris. Sandy, good evening to you. We are at Natural Bridge in Carrollton Court. This is the bus stop where this entire incident allegedly took place this morning. Parents telling us they could clearly hear disturbing language being used. It made me really angry, actually. This mom doesn't want her identity revealed, but she does want to tell her story. She was at the bus stop with her eight-year-old daughter when she says a man working for C and B paving stopped his dump truck for the school bus as it picked up children. She couldn't believe what she says the man said to the school bus driver. The woman took pictures of the driver and his truck. We are not identifying the driver because he isn't charged with a crime. So what I heard the truck driver say verbatim is you effing N-word. Next time, have the effing kids wait. And I just sat there like, oh my God, did he really just say this? The woman says several young children were at the stop along with parents. Crystal Seifert was there with her daughter. She did not hear a racial slur, but did hear profanity. I just heard him say, you could have waited to let those little children on the bus. That's effing BS. Pattonville School District spokesperson Mickey Soonover says the bus was taking kids to Drummond Elementary School in St. Anne. Schoonover says the bus driver could tell the man was upset but didn't hear what he was saying because her window was closed. Schoonover tells me an email about the incident was sent to all of the families with kids who use that route. An administrator at Drummond also met with the children who got on at the stop where the incident took place. Schoonover says some of the students knew the man was mad and at least one child heard some profanity. To hear that um, our students and our staff were potentially um, exposed to abusive and offensive language is disturbing. I want them fired. I want the bus driver to receive a public apology as well as the children to receive an apology. Schoonover says the Pattonville District also notified Bridgeton Police about the incident. Retried twice to get a comment from C and B Paving. The person who answered the first time I called did say that she had taken other calls about this issue today and that she would have someone get back to me. However, I am still waiting. For now, live in Bridgeton, Chris Renier, Fox 2 News.